Today we're checking out a small movie, Brooklyn Guy the Waiter. Let's dive right on in. Karen, 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 there's a job listing to be a waiter at Gordon Ramsay's restaurant. Oh, oh Gordon's God, coming back. Joining? Why don't you just stay home and relax with me? Yeah, Karen, the pay on this job's gonna be crazy. How much? Four dollars an hour. Boynie, that's enough. Yeah, but yeah. are crazy expensive, so the tips are gonna be like a thousand dollars each. If I do one table an hour, I get like a thousand dollars an hour. Wow, that's a lot of money, Boynie, but mm. are you sure that's gonna actually happen? Oh, trust me, it's gonna happen. I'm gonna come home with at least eight thousand dollars today. Wow, well, okay, hmm. Boynie. Okay, I'm gonna go apply for the job. Good luck! All right. Gordon Chef Ramsay Pee -Pee, Hell's right, Kitchen. Right, these mandarin oranges that you prepared for me, my tongue went on. Oh, Chef Peepee's -Pee -Pee working here. But the flight got cancelled, and they lost my luggage. And on the way home, I got into a car accident and became a paraplegic. And the nurse taking care of me shit my oatmeal. Now piss off and never cook again. Uh, uh, excuse me, Mr. Ramsay. What do you want? You're in my kitchen, you bum. Uh, I'm, not, I'm not a bum, sir. I, I'm here about a job. I heard you were hiring waiters. <laughs> oh, right, here. There's your dress. Now, a table just walked in, so piss off! Oh, okay, yes, got it. Pissing off. Alright. Hey there, welcome to Hell's Kitchen. My hey, the Hucker Dudes. I'll be your waiter. Ooh, father, father, he just said us so where? Timmy, shut the fuck up. You want me to take you outside and put you across my knee? But he just said hell. You want to go to the car? No, sir. Take yep. a look at me. Look at me. Zip it. Yes, sir. Alright. Sorry about him, he's a little weasel. No, that's okay. I was just <laughs> gonna ask if you guys wanted something to drink. I'll have your largest bottle of wine. Oh, well in that case, I'd recommend the Cabernet Sauvignon. Alright. I'll have two. Okay, two of those. And I'll have the sun kissed on the rocks. <laughs> okay, I can do that. And I'll have a glass of milk? Uh, we don't have any milk, but we do have coffee creamer. He'll take a glass of that. Okay, sure. I want a Capri Sun. Uh, we don't have um. that either. Aw, man! Just get her a sun kissed on the rocks too. Okay, two sun kissed. Uh, can I get you guys started right. with an appetizer? Yeah, we'll take a bloomin' onion and also a baked potato with all the fixings. Okay. All right. I want cheese fries. Okay. Cheese sticks. Oh, uh, we don't have cheese sticks. You don't have anything that I like. Just get her an order of the macaroni and cheese poppers. Okay. All right. I'll have a side piece of salad with light dressing. And extra croutons, cause you know my fingers are gonna find their way over your plate and take a couple. And extra croutons. Okay. Yeah. All right. Too. Aren't you gonna write this down? Oh no, I don't need to. Get it all up here. Amazing! You can remember all that? Yep. Say it back. Oh, well, you guys wanted uh, two sun kissed on the rocks, two bottles yeah. of Cabernet, a glass of coffee creamer, a uh, bloomin' onion, a loaded baked potato, cheese fries, mac and cheese poppers, a Caesar salad with extra croutons. Simply amazing! Absolutely brilliant. We got ourselves a little Einstein over here. Yeah! yeah I'm just gonna go put all that in and I'll be back to take your order. Uh, actually, we're ready to order now. But you are? You, you sure you don't want me to just run that in real quick? Unless you don't think you can remember it. Oh no, I, I can remember it. <laughs> hit me. Ow! You did say hit you. I, I did. I just uh, yeah. what you want. Alright! I'll take the reins and go first. I'll have the 18 ounce bone in ribeye. Cooked well done. Butterflied with a little bit of blue cheese crumbles on top with some salt and pepper. Oh my god, I'm never gonna remember a goddamn thing this man is saying. This is the longest order I've ever heard. Why didn't I just write it oh down? Why did I have to say I had a good memory? Oh my god, he's still talking. Can't you just order like a normal person? Okay, I have to at least pretend I'm listening. Chives, got it? Yeah, yeah, I got all that. Ooh, ooh, I want an eight ounce sirloin cooked medium rare with ketchup. Uh, 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 Timmy, you know your mother always orders after the man of the house. The one that does all, all, right. all the yard work. Yes, sir. All right, honey, take it away. Uh, what's on your maple barbecue chicken? Well, ma'am, I would mm. assume maple and barbecue. Oh, no, I do not want that. I'll have the grilled right. salmon with four coconut shrimp. I want the lemon on the side and clean the rind. Okay, I can do that. Oh. Uh, would you like to order now? Father, may I please order now? You may. Okay, so I want the 8-ounce sirloin cooked medium rare with ketchup, mayonnaise, and mustard on the side. I also want individual sides of lettuce, tomato, pickles, onion, ooh, and two pieces of bread. Wait, instead of bread, can I get buns? Would you just like a burger? No, I want it how I ordered it. Okay. I don't see PB and j on here. All right, I'll take the reins on that one too in order for She'll have the shrimp and chicken fettuccine, whatever the fuck, and make sure you cut up the noodles to about a cinnamon meter size or so, so she doesn't choke on it. Okay, yeah, all right. I got that too. You got all that? Oh, yeah, I got all of it, yep. Yeah, I'd ask you to read it back to me, but I'm sure you got it that big old brain of yours. Oh, yeah, I got it. Oh, oh yeah, no, you're not going to remember that. Now that's a 
man that can listen. Honey, don't fucking start. Oh, man, uh. I don't remember a goddamn thing those people just ordered. I mean, I remember the drinks and the appetizers, but I don't know what their actual meal is. Damn it, guy, why did you have to brag about being good at remembering stuff? Wait, what do they want? Uh, they're coming. Yes, Mr. Ramsey? Yep. You gotta give me their order, or you gotta stand around with your dick in your hand. Oh, no, 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 sir, no dicks in hands. Well, then give me their order! Okay, so they wanted a, 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 a loaded baked potato. Uh, 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 you didn't fucking write it down! No, I don't need to write it down, I can remember it. Well, clearly you can't, because you're over there, uh, 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 black. Like oh. an idiot. Give me the order. Okay, uh, they wanted a loaded baked potato and a uh, bloomin' onion and cheese fries and mac and cheese bites and a Caesar salad with extra croutons. Now, was that so fucking hard? A little bit. All right, well, then piss off and go get them their drinks and then give me their order. Okay, yes, I will go get them their order. All right, now piss off. Okay, you lovely people, I have your drinks, your two yep. sunkists on the rocks, your coffee creamer, sir. Ma'am, there are your two bottles of Cabernet. Oh, thank you. Yep. Now, sir, you ordered the, uh, uh, well, you know, you know what you ordered. We both know. You don't have to say it unless you want to. That would be fine. Uh, but the chef uh, doesn't believe that you ordered the thing that you wanted the way you wanted it. So maybe if you said it out loud, you might realize you don't actually want that. No, mm -hmm. that's exactly what I want. Hmm. Well, maybe if you said it out loud, you would hear like an ingredient in there that's kind of weird and you mm -hmm. might change your mind. You didn't forget, did you? Oh, no, no. Me? Forget? Just, no, just forget admit anything. that you no, forgot. Honey. Now, honey, you know he has an amazing memory. Oh, uh, yeah. We got Megamind as our waiter. Yeah, yeah that's me. Megamind. But see, the chef, uh, he, he didn't believe me when I told him what you wanted. You know, he, he didn't think somebody would order that the way you ordered it. So so maybe maybe if you uh, you just said that on video, exactly what you told me, and I could show the chef and he'd believe you. No way, Kim Osabi. I don't like being recorded. I don't want Mark Zucker Facebook spying on me. Yeah, oh. of course not. Uh, so, so maybe uh, just your voice. You know, you could just talk and tell the chef what you wanted. Just say, hey, chef, this is what I want, and then tell him exactly what you told me. All right. Hey, chef, this is what I want. I want the 18 ounce bone in ribeye, well done butterfly. Were you recording? It's well done with blue cheese crumbles and salt and pepper. Okay, Mr. Ramsey, I got one of their orders, but he's a big fan, so he wanted to record it in a video for some reason. No phones in my kitchen! Well, if you just listen to it, you can hear what he wants. No, you go get their full order and you come back here and read it to me. Make sure you write it down. Uh, okay, yeah, I, I will do that, sir. Where All the right. fuck are you going? I was gonna go get their orders. There's the appetizers ready, you take them out there to them. Uh, well, sir, it's gonna take me like four trips. No, you're a waiter. It's your job to carry all the food out there. If you do can't it. do it with the two hands that you have, I suggest you grow two more hands. But uh, okay, I guess I'll try to get the fucking food out of my kitchen. Now. Okay. Whoa, whoa, careful, 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 careful. No. Okay, screw it. They're not getting appetizers. Okay, sir, the chef believes you now, and he started mm -hmm. cooking your food. Perfect. And you, ma'am, what you ordered was just incredible. Really inspiring. No one has ever ordered something like that before. Really? Yes, mm -hmm. really. And the chef liked it so much, he wants to make it a permanent menu item. So just take this pen, and then write on the menu exactly what you ordered the way you told me. But it's already oh. on the menu. Not the way you ordered Brooklyn it. Brooklyn guy, you get it so fired. Because it's special. So what was your name again, ma'am? Suzanne. Suzanne. We're going to call it the Suzanne special. Just for you. Honey, Suzanne, you all right. Gonna be famous. That's what we call special treatment. Now, you kid, you ordered a hamburger. No, I didn't. Nah, you kind of did. But I didn't order that. Well, the, the chef said he refused to make what you ordered because I totally remember what that was. And he said he's going to make you a hamburger, so you're getting a hamburger. But I wanted to... You're getting a hamburger. Okay. okay. Now, you girl, you wanted a... Baby and Jay! Yes, and you know what, princess? I will make that special just for you. With crunchy peanut butter? You got it. Yeah, well, crunchy well, peanut butter. What about what she actually ordered? Because she can't have all that sugar. Well, you know what? I will make her a special sugar-free peanut butter jelly oh wow that's yep. what you call going above and beyond just like buzz light here yep that's right oh ma'am you done with that menu yes here you go thank you we're gonna frame this uh, oh hold on, hold on what about the appetizers uh i have yep. bad news about the appetizers see uh th this is coming from the chef because i would never do this to you people uh see he said mm -hmm. that the appetizers were for the lunch menu and, and this, this is the dinner menu so you, you're not getting appetizers okay mr ramsey oh. i get everybody's order written down took you long enough yeah yep. i do need to go to walmart real quick to get the stuff to make a pb and j pb and j this is a michelin star fucking restaurant we don't serve PB &J. but the girl wants pb and j see that that girl she has an allergy that an allergic to everything but PB and J allergies, so I need to do that for her. Well, there's fucking gluten, sugar, and peanuts in a PB and J. What the fuck is she not allergic to? Hey, I'm just telling you what she said, so yep. I'll be right back. Well, hurry up! 
Okay, sir, I got the PB&J in my back pocket. I'm keeping it warm. All right, the food's ready. And let whoever ordered the salmon know that I didn't have any lemons, so I'd use a spare salt. Don't chop the food. Okay, sure, I mean, you're the chef. I'll just take all this out to them. Mm-mm-mm. I got everybody's food. Sir, I got your steak and baked potatoes. Yep. I got your hamburger. Aww. I got your PB&J. You didn't yep. get the crust off? Yeah, well, you didn't tell me to. Aww. Yep. Yeah, so eat it. And I got your fish. The lemons have a lot of seeds in them. Yeah, well, that's because the chef actually ran out of lemons, and he had to substitute lemons for squash. Well, did he clean the mm. rind first? Uh, yes, he did. What's wrong with Hank? Why is he spazzing out? You call this well done? It's still mooing at me. It's saying, cook me moo. Yeah, I am really sorry about that, sir, and I would take it back, but you see, Gordon Ramsay refuses to cook anything well done. And where are my blue cheese crumbles? He refused to do that, too. He said they were moldy, and he threw them away. Oh, yeah. Good call. Okay, so everybody enjoy your food, and let me know if you need anything. Yep. Okay, Mr. Ramsay, I gave him their food. <clears throat> okay, I'm going to go check on him. Okay, hey, just food? one bird. It, all? it was disgusting. Disgusting? Yeah, it was too chewy. I'd like you to take it off the bill, please. Oh, sir, I can't do that. You ate it all, even the bone. Yeah, but it was gross. I had to eat it all the way through to make sure it was still disgusting, and it was. Okay. My lemons didn't add much flavor. Well, that's because it was squash. I like my burger. Oh, well, that's good. That's can good. Can dessert? You sure can. All right, honey, I'll take it from here. We'd like to do the creme brulee with extra berries, the cheesecake with a mixed berry compote, a chocolate mousse and a bread pudding with a scoop of ice cream, a chocolate cookie, and it's also my birthday, so I'll take whatever free dessert comes with that. Actually, you know what? I just remembered that the kitchen's closed, so I can't give you any of that. Oh, darn. All right. Darn shame. Yeah, it sure is. Okay, so here's the bill. Uh, who do I give this to? You can give it to the kids. <laughs> yeah, what? That's, that's very good, sir. Okay, so I'm just going to leave this here, and I'll be back. All right, I'll take care of this old dog. Up. Okay, all Mr. Right. Ramsey, they ate all of it. <laughs> what? What? Mean, what? Mr. Ramsey? Okay, uh, I'm going to go get their bill. Oh, thank God they're finally gone. Oh, but that big tip's gonna be worth it, though. What, what the hell is this? Don't step in front of a moving train? What does that mean? Oh, there it is. Sorry about that, my wife. Forgot the necklace. The hey, hey, just real quick. Uh, for the tip, you said don't step in front of a moving train. What's that about? Yeah, pretty good tip, huh? Well, I mean, tips are usually supposed to like be money. money. Uh, yeah, Extra money. We don't money. leave cash. We just leave tips as in, like, uh, life advice, you know? Well, I can't really oh. pay my bills with that. Well, you make an hourly wage like everyone else, right? I make $4 an hour. Well, if you don't like how much you get paid, then maybe you should work somewhere else. Yeah, well, exactly. exactly. what I'm going to do. Fuck this! <sighs> Boyne, you're home early from work! Yeah, fuck that job. But Boyne, yeah. what happened to $8,000? Oh, I'll tell you what happened to it. Here's my one hour of pay I got, that's $4. And yep. here is my tip. Don't step in front of a moving train. <gasps> oh, Boyne, that's a good tip! Yeah, try mailing that to the electric company <laughs> and see if it keeps the lights on. But Boyne, that's oh, just God. the table and you quit? Yeah, that was the worst experience of my life. What happened? Well, Gordon Everything. me, and then he burped at me, and I think it was supposed to communicate something. Well, Boyne, at least you have a lot of other jobs. Yeah, you're right. True. I don't need it. Cut a bottle! What is your favorite restaurant? Oh, and Big SMG4 replacement is also here. Pretty fucking nice. Alright, um, favorite restaurant. Either Jack Astor's or, um, I also like... McDonald's, but uh, Harvey's is pretty good too. There, there's a bunch of really good like restaurants, whether it's like fast food or just a regular restaurant. But if I have to go like re regular restaurants, like sit down ref restaurants, I gotta say either Jukebox Burgers or Jack Astor's. Uh, these, they're all like Canadian uh, restaurants. So if you don't know what they are, then you don't live in Canada. That's for sure. Hey guys, click on this video. You'll enjoy. It, I swear.